Jeff Carter has been all smiles these days, and why not? Ever since the season began, the fourth-year player has been on fire, always among the league leaders in goals. He's been neck-and-neck neck with Thomas Vanek of Buffalo for the lead league in goals since early on in the 2008-09 campaign. Not even an injured shoulder could stop Carter. In fact, when he injured his shoulder on November 28th, it seemed he turned it up a notch. He scored late in the second period for his 16th goal in the year after taking a hit from former flyer Yoni Pitkinen. Carter says he's 100% now, but apparently the injury didn't phase him then either. No, it didn't. It was just a little bruise and, you know, just part of the game, bumps and bruises and stuff like that. Uh, just play through him and keep going. I think it's just, uh, you know, playing with confidence. I think it's my fourth year now. It's time to really step up and kind of show what I can do. And, you know, I've been finding holes. I think, uh, you know, I've always been a guy that puts a puck on net whenever I get a chance. And I've just been finding holes and uh, going to the net for me. It seems as though Jeff Carter's been on a hot streak for almost the entire season. He's among the league leaders in shots with 127 and among the league leaders in goals, 20 goals. It's good enough for second in the NHL. And those numbers could get him a bid to the All-Star game in Montreal. Well, he's got to be a right-in, obviously, to, to be a starter, so that's that's a long shot. But uh, I'd have to think that uh, the coach that's, that's making the selections um, will look at his numbers, and, and he's a guy that can dominate a game. And in an all-star setting, uh, when it's freewheeling out there and there's going to be a lot of ice room, uh, he's the kind of guy who can do a lot of damage. Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, you know, I'm not really thinking too much about it. Uh, still lots of hockey left here, but, uh, you know, if, uh, if I get a chance to go, I mean, it's always a big thrill for, for anybody in the league, so it, uh, it'll be fun. Before the Flyers' season began, the team signed Carter to a three-year, $15 million deal. While some players aren't as motivated to turn it up a notch after signing a big contract, Carter seems to be doing just that. He won a Calder Cup with the Phantoms in 2005, and now the Flyers hope he can bring a Stanley Cup to Philadelphia as well. 24-year-old Carter has been leading this team by example, and thus far he's had the Midas touch. He's helped to propel this team back in the Atlantic Division race as they look to upset the New York Rangers. And that journey continues tomorrow when they take on the Pittsburgh Penguins. At the Skate Zone in Voorhees, Dave Isaac, Temple News.